Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, so we are, here we are again for another video. Uh, so today we're going to go on a quite long, quite a long road trip. Uh, we're going to go to Karatha. So um, it's about six o'clock in the morning, and we're pretty much just leaving uh, Perth now. And um, yeah, it's going to be 1,500 kilometers uh, from Perth, uh, north of Perth. And so today we're going to try to make it to Carnarvon. Uh, we stay there the night. Uh, Carnarvon is probably about roughly around 1,000 kilometers from Perth. So we go. We're going to go try to get there tonight. <coughs> And uh, and then tomorrow we have a, a easy ride up to Karatha. We we'll think about going to Exmouth and Coral Bay on the way up. So it's going to be excellent. So um, yeah, so enjoy uh, the video and um, <coughs> just uh, come with us on this trip. Will be great. So talk to you guys soon. Bye. Hello my friends, so um, we, we are on our way to Carnarvon and um, yeah it's just uh, taking a, it's taking forever to get out of the city, um, it's been raining, there was massive traffic jams, so um, we're trying to get to Carnarvon before dark because um, we don't want to have any encounters with our friends kangaroos, so um, yeah so we're going to try to get up there before dark which I think we will but uh, we just pretty much just left the city uh, it's just been a nightmare just traffic jams everywhere and so um, yeah so we are probably uh, 350 cases from Geraldton and then I think uh, we've got another 450 or something to uh, Carnarvon so yeah it's gonna be a long drive but it's gonna be good all right guys I'll see you soon bye
guys, here we are again. So uh, we're just about 100 kilometers from uh, Carnarvon. It's been a long day. We've, pro we've already done uh, 900 kilometers today. So yeah, so all together be a thousand kilometers. So it's been a very long day for us. Uh, I can't wait to get there so I can have a bit of a rest and uh, do it all again tomorrow. Um, so far so good, the trip has been good. Um, we still uh, it's still daylight, so we're going to get there just in time uh, because there's a lot of animals on the side of the road. And um, yeah, it's just uh, at the moment we've got we're just in the middle of nowhere. There's no internet, there's no phone connections, there's nothing. So we're just pretty much in the middle of the sticks here. Um, but anyways, I'll get back uh, talk to you guys soon as soon as I get to Canavan and um, go from there. See you guys. So here we are. This is the background, the sunset here in Carnarvon. Um, we're actually looking for a place where we can have some dinner, um, but it seems like everything's closed. But, but anyway, the background is quite nice. Sunset. So we left Carnarvon uh, about two hours ago. We're just not far away from where we're going to stay tonight. Um, because it's peak season, so you get a lot of tourists coming up here this time of the year because of the, um, obviously in Perth it's cold, over here it's quite warm. So they all uh, come up here for holidays. Um, so we're going to, so we couldn't, we couldn't get any accommodation around Exmouth, uh, that's where we wanted to stay, but we actually found a place, we're actually stay, staying in the station, in a cattle station, which is, uh, they provide accommodation for uh, for whoever, whoever wants to stay there, I guess. So yeah, we're not far off it, and um, when we get there, we just sort of like, um, I'll do some filming around there so you guys can see where we're staying. But um, as you can see on the images that I'm uh, filming, uh, as you start coming towards the, the north, the more north you go, the more remote you start getting. So uh, the, the, the land changes uh, massively, uh, it's not so green. Uh, you start seeing a lot more uh, red desert. So um, yeah, anyway, so when we get there, we just, um, I'll talk to you guys again. See you soon.
Hello, my friend. So um, we're just um, staying at this place. Uh, like I said before, we're gonna we couldn't get any accommodation in Exmouth, so we just um, booked in in this um, cattle station, which is about a hundred kilometres um, just outside Exmouth, about hundred kilometres from Exmouth. But it's awesome. I'm just gonna do a video of this place uh, so you guys can see. Uh, the place is uh, Bulara, Bulara Station, apparently it's really well known and um, they just uh, pretty much transform a cattle station into uh, some sort of like accommodation resort sort of, uh, sort of thing but they just left everything pretty much the way it was before so they obviously they, they upgraded and they fixed a lot of things but everything is still very rustic and very much the way it was uh, when used to be a cattle station. They still have cattle here. Um, uh, if you order, for example, if you order some meat at a restaurant and you can cook it yourself on the barbecues, uh, it's all from the station. So um, awesome place. Couldn't, couldn't ask for better. So I'll, I'll, I'll show you guys around and um, all right, I'll see you guys later. Look at these guys. Check these guys out. They're just here all having a good sleep. Look at them. Relaxing. Yay! So they converted this um, this shed here into this was the shear shearer's uh, shed. So they converted it into a bar and restaurant. Mm -hmm. 